This video is sponsored by Lemforder, premium quality products through excellence in engineering. Since the 2011 model year, all power window systems have been mandated to include anti-pinch technology. This technology measures the resistive force being applied by the electric window motor. This feature stops and reverses the window motor to prevent an occupant from being injured. The resistive force can be measured in two ways by the anti-pinch system. First, the force can be measured by the amount of current being drawn by the motor. Second, the position and force can be measured using a Hall effect sensor on the motor assembly. Most vehicles have one type of sensor. However, some vehicles will have two kinds of sensors. No matter how the force is measured, the condition of the window regulator, the tracks, and the motor are critical for the anti-pinch system to work as intended and not cause a false activation. You may get a customer at your shop complaining that it reverses and returns to the fully open position when they try to close a window. Remember, the anti-pinch mechanism can't distinguish between a finger and a damaged regulator. All the system knows is that the motor is drawing more amps or the motor speed has dropped. The root cause of the false activation could be any component that makes contact with the glass. It could be a damaged clip, the regulator, a cable, or even a layer of window tint. This is why it's essential to perform a complete inspection of the window components inside the door and the condition of the track and weather stripping on the door's exterior. Just one damaged component can increase the force required to raise the window. When replacing a window regulator or motor, look at the procedures in the service information. Another option is to scan the QR code on the side of the box for this Lemforder window regulator. The installation instructions can save you from removing unnecessary components or damaging trim pieces. Thanks for watching. Lemforder, premium quality products through excellence in engineering.